I'm Cecilia, and I'm a textile conservator at the Bose Museum. Today I'm going to show you some of the things we're up to behind the scenes while the museum is closed. I'm working really hard at the moment putting together an exhibition of North Country quilts that will be opening soon at the Bose Museum. Because the museum is closed, I've been able to turn this gallery space, our temporary exhibition gallery, into a temporary conservation studio which is very handy because quilts are quite large and it means I can spread out. It's also handy because due to the COVID situation, we need to socially distance and working in a big space like this means that we can. I'm doing as much work as I can on my own, um, but there is a limit to how much I can do with these large quilts. In here, what I'm up to at the moment is just preparing these quilts for photography for our catalogue. That means surface cleaning and humidifying, removing any creases, so that they look as beautiful as they can before the photography. So I have lots of different piles of quilts. And um, starting over here are the quilts that I have finished. Just surface cleaning and humidifying. There's still quite a lot to do to them. The beauty of these ones is that they already have their Velcro sewn on, which is our hanging mechanism. And that saves me a bit of work later on. I'm also beginning to put labels on each of the completed quilts. And that tells me where they're going to be hung in the gallery. Over here, I have quilts that are waiting to be humidified. I've surface cleaned them. I use a low powered vacuum suction, which just picks up any particulate soiling, anything that's sitting on the surface. This quilt has been wet cleaned in the past, so I'm hoping that there's not very much ingrained dirt as well. And there's another one here. And then over here, I have quilt that has been humidified. So it's still a little bit damp. So I've just left it on its own so it can sit and dry off a little bit. I've covered it in tissue because I don't want any dust from the atmosphere settling on it. And when it's damp, it will, the dust will stick to it a bit more and it'll undo all my work. So I'm just covering it over. The tissue's breathable enough that any moisture will be able to get out of it. But that's not it. There are 28 quilts going into this exhibition and there's still a lot of work to do. So over here, I have two piles. I have all these quilts that need work. I put them into two piles because there's so many of them. If I put them in one pile, the weight of them, they'll crush each other. So I'll show you some of these. As you can probably tell, there's all sorts of different quilts going into the exhibition. There's 28 in total, and they range in date from early 19th century through to, we have, we have one being made in the exhibition, that modern. And we've got a variety of types. We've got whole cloth, we've got patchwork, we've got strippy. This is a Sanderson star under there. And these ones are actually curtains, patchwork curtains. So as you can see, there's quite a lot of work to do and I will keep you updated in my progress and you can see the kind of things that we get up to at the Bose Museum. Mm -hmm.